Solve the given differential equation by separation of variables. dy over dx is equal to e to the power of 3x plus 2y. So first, we're going to separate our right side by using this rule. So this is going to equal dy over dx is equal to e to the power of 3x multiplied by e to the power of 2y. Next, we're going to move all our y's to the left side and the x's to the right side. So this is going to equal dy divided by e to the power of 2y is equal to e to the power of 3x dx. And now we're going to take the integral of both sides. So in order, in order to solve this and simplify this, we're going to move the e to the power of 2y to the top. So we're going to have an expo negative exponent. So now the first step, we're going to set negative 2y equal to u. So now we're going to take the derivative of u, and that's going to be negative 2 dy, and we're going to write this in terms of y, or sorry, dy. So dy is going to equal du divided by negative 2. So we're going to do the same thing with our second exponent, and we're going to set v equal to 3x. We're going to take the derivative of v, and that's going to be 3 times dx, and we're going to rewrite this in terms of dx. So dx is equal to dv over 3. So now we're going to rewrite this in terms of the variables that we have chosen. So integral of e to the power of u multiplied by our dy is going to equal du over negative 2. So du over negative 2 equal to e to the power of v multiplied by dv over 3 is going to be our dx, which we're going to substitute here. So next, we're going to take out both constants because the integral does not affect the constant. So we're going to have negative 1 over 2 integral of e to the u du, which is equal to 1 third integral of dv, or sorry, integral of e to the v dv. And now we're left with a simple integral on both sides. So the integral of e to the u is just e to the u. And the integral of e to the v is just e to the v. So we're going to add our plus c. And now to make, to write this in a simpler form, we're going to multiply everything by 6. So this is going to equal 6 times negative 1 half is going to be negative 3 e. So we're going to, our u is going to, we're going to substitute it back as negative 2y. 1 third multiplied by 6 is 2. And our v is 3x. 6 multiplied by c is just 6c. 
And because 6c is just a constant, we're going to set all of this equal to c. So this is all going to equal negative 3e to the power of negative 2y, which is going to equal 2 e to the power of 3x plus c. And that's going to be our final answer. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe.